Have you ever been in the middle of your workday and something happens that sends you into a less than ideal frame of mind? Maybe you get stuck on a particular problem or suddenly things are just coming at you too fast and you just, you can't deal with them all at once. Well, you might start having thoughts like, wow, how am I ever gonna get through this? Or how am I gonna figure this out? Or, oh my God, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Or, you know what, this isn't my area, why am I getting stuck with it? When thoughts like this occur, they get in our way because our focus shifts from the task at hand to why we don't want to do it or why we think we can't do it. Some of us might walk away or break into a cold sweat. It happens to all of us. When things don't go our way, we often have a catabolic or destructive reaction. This means that our thoughts and feelings might slip into self-criticism, fear, and even a victim mentality. We might ask ourselves, why does this always happen to me? Wouldn't it be great to understand where those thoughts and feelings come from? Well, by simply recognizing when we slip into a catabolic pattern, we have the power to choose a perspective that serves us and is constructive. Let's say you're trying to understand a lot of new information and you shut down because it's coming at you way too fast. The reality is, if you get upset about it, it's gonna take longer to process than if you don't. For example, Instead of worrying about how much time and effort it should take for you to get through it, recognize your pain. Take a deep breath and tell yourself that you're processing the information right now. This gets you off the hook and will give you ample space to take it as slowly and as systematically as you need to get through it. So there's nothing personal or upsetting about processing information, it's just a fact. Another form of catabolic energy is anger, one of my personal favorites. So. How might you respond if you were suddenly challenged by a coworker or a boss? Let's keep it clean, folks. You might think, how dare you? Or what's your problem? Or who do you think you are? Again, catabolic thinking. If you feel someone is mistreating you, how likely is it that fighting them will fix the situation? You have a choice here too. Take a breath and think outside yourself. Why would someone come at me like that? Maybe they're having a bad day. Maybe they're feeling their own pressures and can't handle it. Whatever it may be, by approaching it with compassion and understanding, it's no longer personal, and you are far more likely to diffuse the conflict and be able to focus on the issues at hand from a constructive or anabolic perspective. We can't always predict our day, but we can choose whether we're proactive or reactive when things come up. And it may feel a little counterintuitive at first, but I think with time, you'll discover that your days are your choice.